Hello everybody, welcome back to Game Dev Tycoon. Uh today we're gonna be we're gonna be developing a new game. Uh actually I'm gonna do one more contract. I know you guys don't really like me doing contracts, but I uh, I can't do that contract actually. Let's just develop a new game. Uh or we could actually you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to make I'm going to research a game engine. Uh, so when I'm done researching and when I'm done with my new game, I'm probably going to make a game engine, and I think it's going to be a really good one. It's going to look really cool. It's going to make my game seem totally awesome. We successfully researched it. Now we got the game pad. Okay, let's develop a new game. Uh, we can't do the test yet. We'll do the G64. It's a simulation game. Uh, it's a sports simulation game. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it Dodge Ball Simulator. A dodgeball simulator it's 2d graphics of course so now we're going to big counts in the red and now um, so and so the story quest we don't really need story quest it's a dodgeball simulator uh, gameplay needs to be really good engine needs to be somewhat good we'll leave that at that so let's just uh, let's keep going with this I think it's gonna be turn out to be a new smash hit uh, dialogues. We'll kind of get a little bit of dialogue so you can hear our victims ow when you throw a dodgeball at them. Level design doesn't really isn't really that important, but let's just pop these bubbles and we need to pop them good. That's uh that's a little weird statement there, but I don't care. Uh graphics, we'll make graphics good. We need really good sound. Well design really doesn't matter. Uh now we're waiting. And I think this is going to be turn out to be a new smash hit. Let's just wait. We'll get a couple more design points and technology points. And let's finish our game. We've gotten a great new record. And we're leveling up a bunch of stuff. So yeah, here we go. We're ready. Newly released game. Dodgeball Simulator. Um, uh, Star Games gives a nice experience. Great, informed gamer, great, nine. Great game, game hero, nine. Beautiful, all games. Now, star games and all games don't give like that, like us that much, but I got a lot more respect for informed gamer and game hero. So let's uh, let's see how this game sells, cause hopefully our bank account will no longer be in the red. And we're pushing a lot of units, as you can see. Uh, TES will uh, probably do that next, uh, but for now, wait. Uh, we got a company sales record, Dodgeball Simulator, probably our best game yet. Uh, now let's find some contracts, and then we'll be able to um, do a lot more than we've been doing right now. So let's uh, let's do this one. We'll do the debug program. Hopefully we can get this done. We're probably not going to, but I know I just thought it would be a nice idea. Fortunately, deadline is there, and we've got a big penalty on us, which means we need to find a smaller contract. Hopefully we can, uh, well, we probably won't be able to do that. Maybe we can do this one. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just throwing out an idea. I think, I think we have enough time to do it. Except for the fact that my guy is scratching his head like a total nerd and an idiot. Because now we're going to get another penalty. And uh, I think we're... Uh, 11k has been transferred out of our account. Let's create a custom game engine. Mono sound, linear story, save game. Actually, let's develop one more game. Uh, first, we'll have to research a new topic. To research this one, we'll we'll probably research a detective game. 
start our research on that. Don't forget creating custom game engines. I'll do, I'll do that. I'll get, I'll get around to it. Hold on a second. Alright guys, well I'm back. Sorry it took so long. I had to cold clean out my litter box. So, we're going to develop a new game. It's a detective RPG on the G64. Can we do that actually? We'll do that. It's on the test. We're going to call it Incredible. Uh, no, we're going to call it Detective. Detective Incredible. Game, of course. Now our bank account's in the red again. We need really good story quests, so we'll crank that up. We need really good artificial intelligence. We'll just crank that baby up all the way. We wanna, we wanna fully crank the game. I think it's gonna be a really good game with if it's fully cranked. Um, everything needs to be cranked up all the way. Massive success. Uh, yes, that's why I'm using it because of its massive success. Got a lot of points going on here. One more design point, maybe another technology point, maybe another bug. Actually, let's just finish the game. We can get a new record in technology, but we're still we're still profitable. We're still doing well. First reviews of Detective Incredible. Uh, shows potential. That's good. That's good. I like it. I like it too. Have seen better. Okay. Okay. Quirky, but good. Okay. Okay. So this is this is pretty good. This is, uh, let's see how that turned out. And Detective Incredible didn't get so well reviews. Uh, Dodgeball Simulator got really good reviews. I, I, I like that. I like that. Escape, not so much. Swashbuckling, not so much. Uh, Pluto Nash, not so much. But, um, uh, we're, we're shipping a lot of units for Detective Incredible. And I think it's a really good game. I think it's a big, a big, a big step. Uh, the... Vena console. I, I think it's a big step for the company. I'm doing a really good job. I just need to find a contract. Five weeks for that. I don't, I don't trust that. Um, we, we, we might be able to do this one. Well, yeah, I, th I think we'll be able to do this one unless my guy starts stra scratching his head again, which I really don't want him to. Just in the nick of time, we did it. And uh, now we're Detective Incredibles off the market. Now let's, uh, let's, let's develop one more game before we create our custom game engine. It's on the, it's on the test. It's an action game. It's an action military game. We're gonna call it Kill Butt. Kill Butt. Yeah, yeah. This we'll, we'll, we'll call it that. Kill Butt. It's a 2D graphics game. Hit it again. All right. Story quests don't really matter that much. We'll kind of focus on the engine. I, I really want to focus. On, really want to. I'm sorry about that. So um. We don't really need dialogues. We need level design and artificial intel. We don't really need artificial intel. We'll kind of do that since we're multiplayer and some people just like playing with bots. Th th those are losers. Of course, that's what the, the losers are who I'm talking about. Uh, sound. We'll, 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 go, we'll go sound. Graphics need to be really good. World, world design's okay. 
Okay, here we go. Master V has been released. We'll con I'll, con I'll consider that one. I'll consider it. All things considered. We're gonna wait. Maybe we'll get a few more design points. If not, then this game might not be so good. Well, let's wait. Master V stirred up. Okay, now we're ready. No new stuff. I think this will be our last game before we end the video. Now let's see. New release this game, Kill Butt. Came in. We're doing reviews. Quirky but good. Yeah, I probably should have focused more on other stuff in the game. Could have been more. Um, nice experience. Oh, that's good. That's good. Military and action is a great combination. Okay. Let's see how this game did. Game history. Uh, Kill Butt. 7.6. 6.75. I'm pushing a lot of units actually. That's so that's a that's a really good amount of units that we're pushing there. And I think we're finally ready to develop our custom game engine in the next episode. So I guess I'll see you guys later. Uh bye bye.